So I'm here at the Water Cube in Cape Town with uh, Bernal. Bernal, could you just show your, yeah, just a quick zoom in? Well, Bernal, please uh, introduce yourself. Hi, I am the Water Maverick, which means I do what I want for water. Yeah. I am also the Water Institute of South Africa's 2012 conference co-organizer, or one of the team. I am a young water professional, which means that we drive the youth of South Africa and thereby the youth of the world to take action for water in a fun, positive way. Yeah. I'm also for love of water. Oh yeah, that's, a, have, that's <laughs> great stuff as well. That is that, great. That, that's a lot of titles. So, just uh, yeah, you're also in a competition or something, maybe? Yeah? Yes, there's this uh, little competition that the Prince of Orange is coming for, the Mula for a Manzi Business Com Competition. It is a competition to highlight high quality investment proposals or business concepts mm -hmm. where water and business can go hand in hand, sustainable service delivery as well as business. Mm -hmm. And your entry? I am organizing it. I am ah. emceeing it tomorrow. The um, five finalists were shortlisted from a whack of amazing entries yeah. and tomorrow is the finals and we will have a winner. Mm -hmm. They will get prize money of up to 15,000 euro wow. and they have partnered with Dutch and South African companies and professionals to implement it and make it happen. Okay. So we're very excited I'm about that. I'm hoping to get all of them in here so we can hear their exciting ideas and of course the finalists to you know, yeah, cheer them on. Yeah, very exciting. So I mean uh, yeah, it's World Water Day in, in two days. I mean, uh, I mean just to say you have been helping us out already here at the Water Cube because you delivered a great red bean bag, <laughs> dot, we call it the dot, but uh, is there something else, I mean, what, what, there is, you're here for a reason, you're doing a lot of things, but what would you say is for you the, the most uh, critical water issue and, and okay. why, what would you need to do to really start solving that, because there are a lot of issues. Right, of well there, is, there are many, many issues, to me the most important thing is to realize that water is a flux, we have water, we don't have a lot of water, but if we're smart about it, we can have enough water and the solutions that we have are not big or expensive or mm -hmm. government level, they're us, they're every single one of us. Mm -hmm. I am in wastewater, I believe wastewater, adequate wastewater treatment is the first barrier to global human health. Um, I don't believe the f fresh water is very important, but if you don't look after the wastewater and you make sure that you treat the water for the whole cycle, so a whole systems approach, then you're, you're, you're not going to get there. I believe the best way that we can do this is through business. We need sustainable models and that is not just environmental sustainability, that is financial. We need to make sure that people can afford it, but that they're also willing to pay for it. And that comes down to public awareness. So in a nutshell, it's about looking at the big picture and getting every single person to buy into this. Okay. Yeah. That's pretty clear. Okay, well thank you very much. Thank you. And uh, yeah, thanks also for the, the dot, of course. <laughs> we will use the dot. <laughs> Everybody come sit on the dot and take a picture. <laughs> okay, cheers. Thanks. Cheers, thank you.